Hi, I'm Tanner with Trans West Truck Trailer RV here in Frederick, Colorado. Today we're going to go over one of our used inventory units. This trailer is available on the lot today. It's been finished through our shop. This is a 2013 Cimarron Lone Star Stock Combo. 24 foot on the floor. Out of that 24 foot, you're going to have this 4 foot front tack room, 20 foot of stall area with the center cut gate. So it's a really usable trailer, set up typically how we set up our combos. Um, still got a lot of life left in it. We run it through the shop, brakes have been checked, bearings have been packed. It's got a full PDI inspection through all the hinges, latches, lights, anything like that. Completely road safe, road ready trailer, ready for you guys today, which is kind of rare, especially for stock combos these days. They're really hard to find. We'll start off here in the front tack room of this trailer. Here, 32 inch access door in the front side of this trailer. Something I want to point out before we jump in and kind of look at the insides of this tack room is we do have a sliding type window on this door. Something specific to our Lone Star style trailers, we won't necessarily put your windows up in your nose just because that's something we do on the Lone Star models. Now, if you want to order a Lone Star with nose windows, we for sure can do that for you, but for inventory purposes, I assume this was ordered as inventory back in the day, we will put you one sliding type in the door just so you can still get some air ventilation to your tack in this front tack room. But inside this front tack room, really simple, really useful setup, especially for a stock combo. You're going to be hauling horses sometimes, cattle sometimes, sheep, goats, whatever it may be. So we wanted to give you guys the versatility to do so. You're going to have a fully carpeted gooseneck deck. You can throw a mattress up there and sleep in there if you need to. Fully carpeted gooseneck drop wall. And then again, your saddle racks for when you're hauling horses are going to be situated on your short wall of this trailer on your driver's side. There's five adjustable saddle racks in here right now. Again, you can move those, adjust those however you see fit. You can take them out if you only want a couple in there. Um, kind of situate that however you want to set up. Or if you're mainly using this for cattle, you can take them all the way out and get you some more storage space. Here on our partition wall between the stock area, we do have your bridle hooks situated up high, fully carpeted behind those bridle hooks. The reason we do that is really for two reasons. One, it's really going to help maintain the looks of this trailer. You're not going to have to worry about bridles scratching up this trailer. You'll notice that up top where that carpet is, trailer still looks really nice and neat. And then below where they were probably hauling some storage totes and stuff like that where it's not carpeted, it's a little more dinged up. So that's why we like to carpet where your bridles are going to hang. It'll really help maintain the life of your bridles, maintain the life of the trailer. And then on top of that, the second reason is it really limits that noise for your horses. So if you got bridles banging around, scratching around, it can get pretty loud for whatever you're hauling in that first stall of this trailer. So by doing that carpet, it's really going to help dampen that sound as well. Then again, you'll see just how much space you have in this front tack room too, outside of that saddle rack area. You can more than easily store a couple totes in there, saddles, grain bags, whatever it may be. We'll have plenty of room to store stuff in this trailer and still be able to take your tack if you're doing both cattle and horses. The escape door on this trailer is situated on your passenger side of this trailer. So this is your escape door. Again, in emergency, you can jump horses off of this. Or if you want to load cattle, anything like that off this gate, you can easily do so off this escape door on this trailer. It is a paddle latch escape door, not a handle latch. So again, you're not going to have to worry about stuff leaning up against this door. The door is super stout. And then again, your paddle latch will hold that door shut and not just a normal door handle. So making them a little stouter for you guys. Coming down on the side of this trailer, it is a stock side, both head side and tail side. You'll notice there is no tie out rings on this trailer. The reason there's no tie out rings on this trailer is because whichever customer bought this, ordered this, whatever it was back in 2013, they opted to not put plexiglass in this trailer. So that gives them the option every 12 inches they can tie out to one of these tie posts. So plenty of tie options on the outside of this trailer. If you're looking at this trailer, watching this video and think, man, that's a great trailer and I'd really like to have it, but I want some plexiglass for it, we can easily get you guys plexiglass ordered for this trailer and then install you guys some tie rings below that plexiglass if you wanted to use this trailer that way. It is a 610 wide trailer, so you are going to get that full length running board running the whole length of this trailer. You're going to get your tandem Dexter rubber torsion axles and your painted steel wheels. Again, we bring these trailers in, we run them to the shop, we try to clean them up to be, you know, the best possible used trailer these guys can buy. They pull these hubs off, they check your brakes, they check your bearings, they repack your bearings while they have those hubs off. We put a fresh alignment on every single used trailer that comes in so you guys can be confident knowing that this trailer is going to run straight down the road and you're not going to have any issues with anything on this trailer. Coming around to the load side of this trailer, it is a full rear gate with a sliding type gate of about 50% on that. So you have that full rear gate option. You can also slide that if you don't want to open that full rear gate while you're offloading cattle or whatever it may be that you're hauling. And inside this trailer, it is Cimarron's aluminum floor, the strongest floor on the market. Built four inch centers. It is by far the strongest aluminum floor you can get in a horse trailer today. Most companies are going to be built on 12 inch centers, 16 inch centers. 
Cimarron is built on four inch centers. So if you can imagine a four inch center, no matter where a horse is standing, no matter where a ca cattle, sheep, anything is standing in this trailer, they're gonna be standing directly over a support beam on this trailer. Now I wanna point out, again, this is probably a nine, 10 year old trailer. This trailer is in really good shape, especially for being a stock combo. Typically you get a stock combo in and they look a little more beat up just because of what they are and what they're being used for. So this trailer being almost 10 years old, it's in great shape and you can tell that as we walk through the inside of this trailer. Inside of this trailer, again, you're 610 wide. You will have a center cut gate in this trailer. It runs on a slam latch, so you will have a latch on the outside of this trailer to open this gate from the outside, so that way you're not having to crawl in. Like say, for example, you're hauling bulls. You don't want to crawl in here with the bulls to open those gates. You can easily open from the outside. They should swing open on their own when the bulls can push them out while they exit. But the cool thing is, is the latch mechanism here really similar to what we use in our newer trailers today. It is a metal on plastic latch. So that way this gate's not gonna rattle as much. It's gonna be really vibration proof. And on top of that, metal on plastic doesn't wear like metal on metal does. Metal on metal will tend to grind and wear down. It'll get looser and looser and rattle until eventually it just won't latch anymore to where metal on plastic, it takes a lot longer for that plastic to wear down versus metal on metal. And it's gonna keep it really quiet for your animals. On top of that, with it being a stock combo, this gate will latch out of the way and you will just have a wide open trailer if you wanted to run it like that. So not only works great for your horses, cattle, sheep, goats, whatever you're gonna be hauling in here, but it's real easy to jump, you know, UTVs, ATVs and stuff in this trailer as long as they fit. So you can use this trailer for pretty much anything you wanna do on your ranch or in your personal life. Standard in every single Cimarron trailer, whether it be a Lone Star model, a North Star model, a Wind Star model, you are gonna get a fully insulated roof running the whole length of this trailer and that includes in your tack room. That insulated roof, it's gonna reflect the heat off of this trailer. If you're stuck in dead stop highway traffic in the middle of summer in some of those warmer states, it can get pretty hot. So this roof is really gonna help keep it cool in here for whatever livestock you guys are hauling. We do have LED lighting positioned throughout this trailer. You're gonna have about one LED light for this front stall. You'll have two in the back. Again, you can switch those on from the rear of the trailer and give you enough light to be able to see what your animals are doing in here. That way, if you stop at a gas station and get fuel, you can easily click those lights on, crawl up on that running board, check on your animals, and make sure they're hauling safely. Out back, you will have an LED low light. It'll give you an ample amount of light right here while you're loading. So that way, if it's early morning, late night, and you have to offload or jump on some livestock on this trailer, it's gonna give you plenty of light so you don't get in a jam while you're loading. It's also gonna give your animals plenty of light so they can kind of see what they're doing while they're jumping on and off this trailer and really save you guys from having accidents. Moving down your head side or your driver's side of this trailer, it's gonna look really similar to that passenger side. Again, no tie rings. You are gonna have tie posts every 12 inches to tie out to. And then this is that latch mechanism on the outside I was talking about. It's really simple, it runs on a spring. Basically what it does is it disengages that plastic latch on the inside. When you pull it out, it's gonna take that latch off that gate so it should swing open. Your animals can push it open. You're never gonna to have to get in the trailer and worry about an animal pushing a gate into you. Again, safety is one of Cimarron's top priorities. So every trailer they build, whether it be this 2013 or one of the new 23 models, safety is a top priority and every aspect of that trailer has been ran through and thought, how can we do it better? So move up towards your front area. Again, you'll notice no kick out windows in your front nose area. If you're ordering a Lone Star model, we can get you those, like I mentioned. Underneath, it is just a standard, standard hand crank jack. You will have your spare tire mounted next to that jack. We can upgrade these jacks super easy, whether it be on this trailer, or a trailer you guys own personally, maybe if you're looking at a different trailer that has a hand crank, it's super easy for us to run these through our shops, put on an electric over hydraulic jack, or change things like that for you guys. We have a world-class shop here at TransWest, not only jacks, but if you guys want your trailers checked out, what rails added, what tie rings added, we can do all that stuff here. Um, even if you're looking at a trailer and want to add stuff before you buy it, we can do that here as well. Up front, we do have your 2 and 5 16 coupler, your safety chains, and your breakaway system for your breakaway uh, brakes. And that also has been fully serviced through our shops. When they pull them through, they're going to check those breakaway brakes, check all your lighting. Like I mentioned before, they check everything on this trailer to make sure you guys are getting a top quality used trailer. If you're interested in this trailer we went over today, the stock number for this trailer is 5U221762. Again, it's a 2013 used Cimarron Lone Star stock combo. It's a 24 foot on the floor with a four foot front tack. If you're interested in this trailer, maybe some other trailers we have in, whether it be used or new, or maybe you want to place a custom order of your own, feel free to give me a call. Again, my name's Tanner here at TransWest Truck Trailer RV in Frederick, Colorado. Phone number is 303-684-3409. Thanks for tuning in.